Adrian. I'm a member of the Visible Banking Team. Since 2007, we've championed and curated social media and digital innovation and financial services. Our team has tracked over well over 3,000 social media assets in 80 plus countries. And in this video series, we aim to review a wide range of iOS apps from banks, insurance, and financial service with a f uh, firm key focus on customer expectation and brand consideration. In today's review, we're taking a look at Waze and our angle with this app uh, with the recent Google acquisition. What's the hype with Waze? You know, what's the value uh, and power of crowdsourcing? So, you know, uh, this is a really interesting app. Basically, it's a GPS map and traffic uh, for the iPhone application. So we're kind of taking a look, you know, should, it, should insurance companies uh, partner with innovative services like Waze? Would a partner like a ship like this generate some online sales? Let's go ahead and take a look at the app first here. Um, so Waze, again, like I said, is a GPS maps and traffic for the iPhone here. So you can see here I can track around. I can uh, browse around simply by seeing the location map. It has a really nice detailed map here. You can see this is just an outer view. If I was to go more in depth, it gives it more in depth uh, look at the roads, all that stuff. You can pinpoint your location simply by clicking this and it lines you up with your location here. You can see it has support for landscape and portrait mode. In the bottom left, you can navigate through the menu. It has this nice little menu system here, so you can choose to navigate. You can see categories if you're looking for specific things, like let's say you're looking for a bank or ATM. It'll show you everything around you using certain search engines, and it'll tell you how far they are away. So you can see that's not too bad. It's really convenient for finding things close to you, whether it's a car wash, car repair. So I can say car wash. It'll search again, find things near me, and you can see if I click it here, it will actually show me on a map where it's at. I can go to a full screen. I can say go. And what it'll do is it'll calculate the route. And you, and you can see there it gives you that audible feedback. It tells you how far away. Uh, and then you can you just click out here and you can see, uh, what do you call that? It gives me directions. It shows me how far it is all the way down there. And you can see I can zoom in on the map. Really nice, you know, detailed the map here. Uh, but what's so special about Waze is a couple of other features it integrates. So you also have the ability to switch off, have see reports. Uh, view friends settings because it is based on social here so you can see social networks integration all that good stuff uh, clicking on the social button right here what you can do is you can send reports so you can send reports to other users using ways things like hazards uh, traffic jam if there's a police you know kind of speed speed clocking people closure of a road um, you can have map chat so this does this allows you to kind of alert people who are driving around you if there's an accident so they know to kind of navigate around traffic it's a social way to kind of give uh, people ahead what's you know or people a heads up of what's coming up on the road and around them additionally you can use this nice little interface here to slide to navigate here and get into more settings here so what I can do here is I can just take this slide it to the right and you can see here you can navigate adding things like your home your work uh, other stuff like that that way you can uh, it, it learns where you are and how to navigate from depending on locations that you have saved up so again it's a really interesting it's you know a really nice GPS as you saw there it has nice maps and traffic control but what's interesting about Waze is that again like I said you can report these these police if there's uh, a hidden or visible police you can share the details you can take a picture you can do all these things now this is an interesting way to kind of um, you know spread information of what's going on around you and on the road uh, socially and this is you know definitely that power of crowdsourcing and it, you know it has those live updates and all that stuff here with a nice GPS built on top now if I was to rate this at an overall score on its usefulness I would definitely give it you know a 7 out of 10 it's very useful in, the, in terms of GPS and navigating and all that it, you know it's a fun and really clean to use GPS you know the interface is easy to use it's really simple and all that um, but the only interesting thing here to me is that this social you know the social aspect of GPS and all that kind of also proves a danger you know a lot of people are kind of clocking in these things and they're reporting these things while they're driving uh, I think it's a, it's a safer option obviously yeah you can have somebody else do it while you're driving or pull over to the road if you're gonna report anything but it also opens up you know that safety factor um, into into putting these report features that it has in here and, and, and reporting things and logging things while you're driving so it's de definitely something you want to use at a certain you know uh, use case now also um, the maps aren't as you know smooth as other applications that I've tried out the maps aren't as detailed uh, they are kind of a bit um, there's some lag to it at times you'll notice that the buffer uh, rate when it loads maps I've, I've seen other GPS applications do it a little bit better um, and you know whether or not insurance companies should partner with innov innovative services like Waze I think it'd be interesting because it, you can I think you would definitely see a generation of online sales um, it would it'd be interesting to see if you can integrate it nicely with all those services so when they're looking for certain services through the Waze menu that could be a category so I think it's definitely something that uh, people or a company should in, in you know definitely consider so what do you guys think about Waze what do you guys think uh, you know it, do you guys think it's useful 
do you find that you would uh, you know use it as a GPS application as well as those social features? Definitely let us know. And of course, don't forget to check out uh, your, you know your. Also, don't forget to leave your suggestions for future app reviews. They're also welcome. But if you enjoyed this video, we invite you to like it, subscribe to our YouTube channel for more, and visit of course visiblebanking.com to learn how to excel in digital engagement and achieve social media ROI. So thanks a lot for watching, guys, and I will catch you all in the next video.